At Eurobor, our main topic will always be safety. That's besides cost savings and time savings. So today I'm going to show you something which in the, in the recent period we started to realize it's, it's a kind of a problem and that's this, this cable. Um, what we experience is that most operators intend to carry the machine instead of the handle they intend to carry it on the cable. Um, of course it's not made for that but it just happens. So um, the reason why it happens is, well I think for mainly two reasons. One, people don't want to bend too far so they take it on the cable, it's easier to, 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 to lift it up. Second reason is that the cable is pretty close to the carrying handle which is uh, taking away some comfort of grabbing it by the handle. So the problem will be that if they carry it here most often this can happen on any moment like this. This is about safety because you can have a an, an short circuit and you know accidents can happen. So the machine won't work anymore, it needs to be sent to repair. Uh, it depends how long that's going to take with all the shipping costs involved. That's going to be expensive besides the repair itself, which might run around $200 depending if it has affected the PC board or it was the cable only. There's also a third factor which has nothing to do with carrying the machine on the, on the cord or on the cable. That is if you're in the surroundings where there's obstacles over there, you carry your machine and you hold it like this and there you go again. So what is the solution over here? Well actually I got the solution right here. No cable. What we've done over here is the cable runs internally behind over here, goes up in the machine, enters the motor unit over here. So there's no cable anymore, there's no obstruction of carrying it and uh, the operator is refrained. Since there is no cable, he cannot carry it on the cable anymore.